Welcome or welcome back at I need help at C squared. In this example, we're going to solve this radical equation. That's the way you call this equation. And we're going to try to find the real solution. So let's see how we do that. We have cubic root of 2x minus 4 minus 2 equals 0. The first step whenever, whenever you have a radical equation is to isolate the radical. So here First thing I'm going to do, I'm going to add 2, and that will isolate the radical, in this case, the cubic root, 2, cubic root of 2x minus 4 equals 2. And here we're going to do the inverse operation of taking cubic root, which is raising to the third power. All right, I'm going to raise to the third power, that will be the inverse operation of taking cubic root and whatever I do on the left side I'm going to do on the right side so basically now the cubic root and the power of 3 cancel out and we have 2x minus 4 here and 2 to the third power is 8 and then we're going to add 4 here and we have 2x equals 12 divide by 2 x equals 6. Now what you want to do whenever you finish this type of radical equation you want to check the solution. Okay sometimes you have you can have what we call extraneous solution and how you find if it's an extraneous if it doesn't work by just plugging in. This is a cubic root so it should be no problem. Another way to look it at if you have a graphing calculator you can uh, graph this equation in this format. Do you see what I did here? I put cubic root of 2x minus 4 minus 2 on y sub 1. Okay, and then this is the graph. You click on the graph button, which is right here, by the way, in case you need it. Okay, by the way, if you need that cubic root, use the second catalog on TI 83. Okay. And this is a graph. In this case, I'm going to look. This is the point I'm looking for because it needs to be equal to 0. It's one of the intercepts. It's the x-intercept. Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Yeah, it looks fine to me. Okay. Uh, if you enjoyed this, don't forget to click the like button and come back on C-square for more help. Thank you.